This is Witchbase News for Friday the 30th of October 2020 ...I'm Commander Burr. In this weeks news ...the Frontier Halloween in-game event reaches its creepy conclusion ...horizons for everyone and more. If you enjoyed this video remember to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications and if you'd like to support our work you'll also find us on Patreon. Links to everything you need are in the description below. As the community team at Frontier had hinted some weeks ago ...this week saw the arrival of the Elite Dangerous Halloween event and it was a doozy. As we've been reporting all week the event started with hints of something afoot on social media Cryptic messages in binary code began appearing on the Elite Dangerous Instagram page whilst the games Twitter account lit up with a mysterious screenshot and a link to the Instagram page. The binary code messages continued over successive days until Wednesday when the full message could be decoded. It read Colsack Nebula The Stones He Keeps Watching The Stones With the location of something revealed a large portion of the player base headed off to search the Colsack Nebula for further clues but it wasn't until the game came up on Thursday after an extended scheduled downtime that things started being discovered. Fear not we won't go into spoiler territory here in this video but we will say that a Galnet news article appeared in game detailing the arrival of a long lost megaship called the Adamasta in the Chuck Chan system that then sent players off on a galactic mystery tour the like of which has not been seen in Elite Dangerous in a long long time. When the event started it brought with it a level of engagement and mass group activity that had been sorely missing. Whilst it wasn't without some small problems ...at the time of this recording there are a couple of bugs with the mystery tour that still need to be ironed out the explosion of frantic player activity that the hunt for the story of the Adamaster caused would surely have proved to Frontier as if there were ever any doubt that the player base is still very very active and hungry for more of just about everything in Elite Dangerous. Fear not ...if you've not yet followed up on the events of yesterday in game the things that have been added are not going anywhere. This isn't a week long thing and then it's gone kind of a deal. The story that surrounds the Adamastor is very much a permanent thing and fleshes out yet more of the Elite Dangerous lore and is a permanent addition to the existing game so there's plenty of time to experience it yourself when you're ready. Not content with the events in game however Frontiers community team weren't done with Elite's commanders entirely. As the community was wrestling with the mystery of the Adamaster, the community team released a hilarious spoof edition of the Super Cruise news broadcast that frankly has to be seen to be believed. I'm not kidding ...it's linked below. Special mention has to go to community team regular Stephen Block Benedetti for driving for 6 hours from Scotland to Cambridge yesterday morning to help with the Dave's events and appear in the video alongside Bruce Vantana Garrido and Arthur Anchorman Tolmy. With the out of game hints, the news broadcast and then the suitably creepy but still completely in universe in game horrors that, we think, hint at more for the future ...it was easily one of the best Halloween events we've seen in any online game. As we've already said this stuff has added to the permanent elite backstory and lore and is a permanent addition to the game rather than a throwaway week long event so there's plenty of time to experience it all for yourself. Here at the pit we're still not done with following up all the Halloween in game content ourselves but with what we've seen already we're happy to report that Frontier have absolutely smashed it wholesale. Bravo team. As was expected this week the Horizons expansion was folded into the main game making way for the Odyssey expansion next year. This means that the base game now includes planetary landings on airless worlds, access to the engineers, ship launched fighters and SRVs, multi crew and more. If you already owned Horizons then every ship in the game SLFs included now have access to a shimmery new azure paint job and as an added bonus this week the game now with Horizons included is currently on sale on Steam on the PC for around 75% off meaning in the UK you can pick it up for about 5 quid. 
And finally this week as part of the Halloween season there are some new bobbleheads on sale in the in game store to festoon your dashboard with creepy delights. The horror themed bobbles will only be available during the Halloween season so don't wait to grab them if you're in the market for such a thing. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time.